What's up guys, it's the only ninja wing Avers and Super Rap bringing you another video here on the Modern Ninja channel. And welcome to Weapons Explained, the series where I chase clout by talking about weapons on the internet. Is it the best plan? Not necessarily, but it's my plan, so here we are. Before I get started, I want to let you guys know, um, I have a Patreon. Um, I released it a little bit ago, so if you are interested in checking that out, checking out the benefits that you get from being on it, please check out the links down below. It helps me out, even a little bit helps me out, so if that's you and you want to help me make content, I super appreciate it if you do. But, let's get back to the video. Only the edgiest of edgelords that needs to be unrelentlessly dark and angry because they are eternally in search for the sweet, sweet edge. The side. Looking for trouble? Cause you found it. It's business, not personal. Shut up and let's do this. The Sai is basically a mini trident that is meant to be dual wielded, used by the Okinawan martial artists. Man, you know, in doing this series, I have realized Okinawans have made so many weapons. Like, they have pioneered so many weapons. So, to all you Okinawan viewers, if I have any, thank you. They were actually given to the domestic police force, very helpful in arresting criminals and using them in crowd control situations. There are also a variety of different styles of size, each with a very unique design. Different lengths of the blades, shape of the blades, and even the direction of the side prongs can be different from one style to the next. In modern times, size are the most common in Kung Fu. However, many people are starting to bring them into more extreme styles of martial arts, probably largely due to the popularity of the Ninja Turtles. Lightweight aluminum size are being used for tricking and XMA performances that can be truly spectacular if you ever get the chance to see one. And for those of you that don't know, XMA is a new, relatively new style of martial art that is basically what happens when a Power Ranger created a martial art. Yeah, a Power Ranger literally created a martial art. That's not even an exaggeration. That's literally how that art exists. Check out the links below or in the corner or wherever it is if you want to know more about that. Now, size are one of my favorite weapons, and if you enjoy them as well and want to get your hands on a pair of size for yourself, uh, definitely check out the links down below. I'll leave some to uh, some lightweight size, and I'll leave some for some heavier size for training, depending on what you want to do with your pair of size. So, you know, you got options. But until next time, don't forget to do all the normal YouTube stuff, like like, comment, subscribe. That all helps me out. And share the video if you have a friend that you think would enjoy this. Please let them know. Share the good word. But until next time, my name's DJ Moore, this is the Modern Ninja, and I'm out. Raphael wins. Nice. Pepperoni.